What's up guys, in this short tutorial, I will show you how to boost your FPS and overall performance by playing Rainbow Six Siege on your PC. This should be quite an easy tutorial, but if you still have any questions, then leave a comment and let me know. First, we will go over the in-game graphics settings, as these can make the biggest performance difference on low to mid NPCs. In the General tab, enable the Display Game Info option, which will show you your current frame rate latency and game version in the lower left corner of your screen. This will help you determine which tweaks help you out the most. In your display settings, make sure to set the resolution to your native monitor resolution. In case you're using an abnormal screen resolution, as I am, then set it to 1920x1080, as it will save you a lot of resources. In case none of these tweaks helped you out as much as you wanted, then you can lower this option even more. This will in any case improve your overall performance, but the visual quality will suffer a lot. Below, set the display mode to full screen. I have set it to windowed as it's easier to record. You should in addition disable the VSync option. In the graphics tab, set the overall quality preset to low or medium, depending on your system specs. I prefer to set this option to medium and to set the shaders and reflection quality options to low. Below, set the anti-aliasing option to TAA and set the render scaling option to 100%. I suggest you try these options out before moving to the next tweaks to compare by how much your performance has increased. In case of bad performance, you should lower the render scaling option to about 75 and try again. When this is done, leave the game running and open up your task manager. Right-click your taskbar to open up your task manager. Here in the Processes tab, right-click Rainbow Six and select to go to Details. In the Details tab, the Rainbow Six.exe application should be highlighted. Simply right-click it and set the priority to High. This will in turn allocate more resources to playing the game and should increase your performance, especially if you have other programs running in the background. In order to reduce the CPU utilization from other programs, I suggest you to answer programs from running in the background, which you don't need when playing the game. But make sure to only add the programs from running, which you know won't break your operating system. In the Startup tab, you can additionally prevent programs from starting up on system boot. You can now close the game and exit out of your task manager. When this is done, Search for Game Bar to open up the Game Bar system settings. Here, uncheck the Recording option, and in the Captures tab, make sure to additionally disable the Background Recording option. These settings will only reduce your performance. If you want to record your gameplay, then I suggest using OBS Studio or an external capture card if you lack performance. Next, make sure that your graphics driver is up to date. I suggest using the GeForce Experience application, if you're using an NVIDIA GPU, but you can also use the AMD driver suit. Depending on how frequently you're updating your GPU, this tweak can make the biggest difference. In the Drivers tab, simply click on Download and the application will automatically download and install the latest driver. When this is done, search for Update to open up your Check for Updates System Settings window. Here, click on Check for Updates, and after downloading the latest OS update, make sure to restart your PC. When this is done, right-click your desktop and select NVIDIA Control Panel. You can do the same step with the AMD driver suit. Here, navigate to Manage 3D Settings and then Program Settings. Select to add a program to customize, and then add Rainbow Six from the program list. Below. We will change a few settings. Make sure that the CUDA setting is set to your main GPU. Set the power management mode to prefer maximum performance and set the texture filtering quality to performance. Lastly, search for graphic settings and open up your graphic system settings. On this window, select browse and your file explorer will open up. From here, navigate to the drive on which you saved the game on. Program files Steam, Steam Apps, Common, Rainbow Six Siege. 
Make sure to select the Rainbow Six application and then add it to the program list. Once it's added, you can change the options of the application so that the graphics preference is set to high performance. Don't forget to apply your changes. I hope this helped you out. Leave a comment if you have any questions and see you in the next one.